Northwest Ohio with its largest contingent of state qualifiers in years. LCC, both singles and doubles, Shawnee singles, Bath doubles, and Bryan doubles all competing today at the state tournament. We start with LCC. Libby Simmons is back to state starts her morning on center court against South Point's Meredith Riley Simmons on the return. Volley going here. Riley with a drop shot into the service box. Simmons scoops the ball, gets the volley at the net. She gets the point in this one. Simmons now with a strong serve down the tee. Gets a high return here. She finds an open shot, puts it out of reach. Simmons with strong play, but comes up short 2-6. 1-6. LCC doubles a team of Paige Brinkman and Claire Janowski taking on Austin and Walker of Maslin Perry. Janowski was serving, returns the forehand, lobs it high. The lob game works. Perry lobs it out. Brinkman serving now. Hard return here. She finds the short angle. Perry hits it out, but still gets the overall win over LCC. 6060. -oh, -oh. Next to Alora Patel, our senior from Shawnee, who's also back to state again. This morning she took Hathaway Brown's summer moo, took on her rather. Alora looking strong in the rally, slices, then adds a one-handed backhand to get this one. Alora with a strong serve down the middle, sustains the rally with strong shots forcing her opponent to hit it out. A great high school career for Alora Patel, who falls to a very tough opponent, 2-6-0-6. Back to doubles action. Baths, Elena, and Ann Oliver on a back-to-back -back return trip to state, taking on a tough Gates mills Hawken team in round one. Ann serving, showing strength in a long rally until Elena gets the Nets action, smashing the overhead. Just a little bit later in the same point, Ann is still serving. Elena with the two-handed backhand volley at the net, and then she puts it away with a forehand and angled volley. The Oliver sisters did not give up, but didn't get the win. Gates Mill Hawken takes 6 2 4 6 for the win. Now, here could be the biggest surprise of the state tournament. This is the Bryan doubles team of Reese Grothaus and Caitlin DeWitt. The number three seed from Northwest Ohio comes out strong against the Southwest number one seed, Marietta. DeWitt serving here. Grothaus takes the shot out of the air, two-handed backhand volley forcing to the opponent's feet. DeWitt and Grothaus take the win, 6-0-6-2, making them the first girls in Bryan tennis history to make it to the quarterfinals. They didn't get past the next round, losing 2-6-1-6 to the Mills, sister from Hathaway Brown, but congratulations to the Bryan's doubles team for making school history. I'm Jennifer Beck for the Sports Report.